On go from three. All right. Are you guys ready? I'm ready, guys. I am ready. Let's do this. Okay. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one. Go! We'll try it. We'll try and take it easy on my voice today. I highly doubt it, though. We got Zicky Beast audio right now. Let's turn my fan on. We got Shirai for Mario versus Zikibi, both the winner of their round one. Zikibi getting the one up there. That is to guarantee that he can get the 20 lives when he beats the game. For anyone who doesn't know, the world one consists of the first frame jump in the Hammer Brother and staying ducking while you're on the airship. The world one airship. All right, let me take this opportunity to go ahead and make sure that True Hyper's audio is also good. Go ahead and switch it over. Yes. Driver also has good audio. Both runners making it out of 1-2. This is going to be an interesting race. It could be one of the best players of Mario 3 right now, having one of the better uh, PBs of records. Bumps on the overall map, though. And uh, True Hyper Mario, um, not... Nice, okay, they both avoid, avoid the orb. Driver Mario is not the, uh, I don't think he's competed a whole lot in uh, Mario 3, but he's doing a great job. He went up against Super Sonic, and he won his first race, and now he is in round two um, against a fierce opponent. So, is this gonna be, is this gonna be a run of um, one person going really fast, and one person not going as fast, but getting more points, right? We have seen people with more points Less on the time, right? It's about the points. So it could be getting the tunnel and taking that little time lead right there. That's right, guys. That's how the tunnel works. Tunnel is those little frame saves right there. See if either of these runners will use a lifeline. Who knows, though? All right. They are not far from each other. And it looks like True Hyper Mario not only being against one of the... One of the hardest players is like he's holding his nerves man he's doing a good job and of course as I say that okay he's gonna have to turn back oh my god the stupid hole in the floor there we go he's got it he's in there all right Zigabee's gonna try and go for the first frame jump he gets the first frame jump Zigabee gets the first point right there Whew. all right here we go try for Mario's turn for the first point Driver Mario also gets the first point right there. They both get the fire flower, and it is now time for both of them to do the duck strat on the airship. Whee! Oh, he's gonna go for the mushroom house. Does he get the fire flower? First mushroom house. Oh my god, he does get it. What is that RNG right there, dude? Wow, look at that, dude. Look at that. Zikubi's gotta duck the entire time while being on the ship. No peeking. No peeking. Let's see how it goes. This would be big for True Hyper if True Hyper uh, doesn't peek and Zikubi does peek. It would be a big thing. No peeking on either side. Let's go ahead and switch over to Zikubi's audio. No peeking on Zikibi. He does get the points. A full clear world one. Neither runner uh, using that strat that we've seen earlier in the tournament. There's a strategy where uh, you can let the wall actually push you. Stuck in a rough place. Nice! And True Hyper also get it. Two people with the full clear world one. This is pretty crazy, actually, man. This is pretty crazy. No peaks right there, and they both get it, man. Wow. Mmm, mmm. It's almost Sody Pop time, guys. All right, here we go. Peace Beat Strategies. Everyone knows that after 2-1, you always get a movement of two, so... We can get some RNG points, we can get some sun kill points. It's gonna be interesting to see how these runners decide what they want to do. I mean, if you get a full clear in World 1, should you worry less about other things? I don't know, man. We'll see how these guys will do it. 
Uh, True Hyper has already done the Mushroom House, so he is actually in the clear. So if True Hyper knows a way of doing his inventory in World 2 and in World 4 without doing Mushroom Houses, he can save a lot of time, especially if Zikubi is going to be looking in his inventory, trying to get flowers, see what happens. Does Zikubi get a star here, though? He does not get a star. Star, star, mushroom. Very scary there. Looks like True Hyper Mario is going to get Flower Star Mushroom two times in this run. And Zikubi already getting a movement of one right there, so you can count that off the board. You can count it off the board. Alright, getting early P-Speed in the Fortress. Meanwhile, True Hyper Mario gets past the Moat of Tears. Nobody falling in the Moat, man. I love it. I love it. Oh, that's right. I guess there's no reason for True Hyper to do an, an extra turn back, right? There's no reason, so... All right, let's see how it goes. Movements of one versus movements of two. Another movement of two. Oh! Thought he had got the last shot off on Zikubi's side, but he didn't. It, it was probably going to be a frame-perfect shot, and he ends up taking damage right there. Ends up taking damage. True Hyper is going to be able to catch up a little bit in time right there. Zikubi not doing Ring Around the Rosie, but he is actually going to go for the music box. So interesting is True Hyper, if he gets the hammer before the music box, then he can hammer, then music box, instead of Mushroom House. But, again, he's going to want to get some of those time saves, right? So we'll see how this goes. Alright. He gets another movement of two, so... They, they end up being in the same level now. Alright, they are now in the same level. Drew Hyper with that one extra point right here. And it's still getting- Whoa! You gotta go back and grab that other turtle shell, man. That is unfortunate, dude. That is unfortunate. Nintendo with the- with the soft lock. Look at this. Like, what the heck, Nintendo? That is so cheap, dude. There you go. He's got it. Okay, he's out. Wow, that sucks, man. That has got to be the worst thing to happen. He clipped through the block and killed them both. Bet you guys have never seen that before, have you? And he definitely takes damage on that turtle shell. But he is out of there. Critical thinking, guys. He did make it work. He made it work. Wow, not too bad. Not too bad at all. And he gets a movement of one, so he can kiss those moves to two. Goodbyes. All right, now it's time for the sun level. That is unfortunately gonna put him a little bit behind, right? That is a big time loss right there, having to run back and forth with those stupid uh, turtle shells. That is like, uh, I I'm sure a lot of you watching today have never seen that before. Never seen that before, right? All right, so he's gonna have to stand still probably. Just wait for the sun. Boom, gets the sun kill, nice. He's out of there. Both players getting the sun. Damn, I kind of want to see somebody get, like, a full clear. Alright, Zikubi's gonna have to go for the Mushroom House. Does he get the Fire Flower? He does not get the Fire Flower. But he, does, he doesn't have two items touching. And True Hyper Mario is going to have to do... Nice, gonna get that Mushroom. It's a very interesting strat of getting a Mushroom. I like it, though. I like it. Not overly common. You don't normally see that. You see... The good thing about this tournament is that most runners, right, if Zikubi ever lost his Fire Flower on that Fortress, he would have reset, right? So you never see how how a lot of uh, world record holder runners kind of do like backups and, and stuff. Which, like, for the most part, we know them, we just, you never get to see them because what's the point in not resetting in World 2? True Hyper going for the Shell Grab, a very interesting Shell Grab, I might add. And he's about half a level Hammer Brother behind, so maybe two levels behind here. Very nice. The Pyramid is not an easy level. The Pyramid is a very, very stressful level. Oh, that was close. Not getting the, the, the flower, though. But he's got lots of time, man. He's got lots and lots of time. Hammer Brother. Oh, that is really nice, man. If that Hammer Brother moved left, that would have sucked. I wonder if he's going to go for the Music Box, Mushroom House. I wonder what he's going to do here. Unless he just knows he's got to go for the star. Maybe he skips the Hammer Brothers in World 3. This is interesting. This is very interesting. How do you guys feel about this run so far? How do you guys feel about this run so far? Because it's, uh, it's pretty close, man. It's not like we've seen. 
we've seen further runs from World 2s, right? Like, we've seen people... What are you giving me the MFP DP for? Alright, so he gets the fire kill right there. Goes for the Oscar one grab. Does he get it? Oh, I think he just missed it. Oh my god, so close, but not quite. So that's going to that's going to actually be a time loss right there. It's going to be a time loss. Very close, but unfortunate little uh, little slip up. Wow though. Wow. That was close. No, that's it. You gotta be a little higher, man. You gotta be a little higher on the wall. That would have almost been a lot of points in uh, season season one. You remember season one had off-screen wand grab. All right, True Hyper. As long as True Hyper does not take damage on this boss, he should be good here. He should be good. All right, three one on Zikabee's side. Oh wow, very nice uh, fire kill at the end there on True Hyper's side. So he's about the cutscene away. So maybe close to ooh missing the jump. Gets a wall jump off-screen wand grab, but misses a basic jump. Come on, Zikabee, get it, get it, get it. Come on, buddy. Get it together. You got this. Alright, here we go. Does he get the star? Which I'm pretty sure he should. And he does get the star. So all he's got to get is a mushroom. And uh, from speedrunning, he definitely knows how to secure the mushroom. Definitely knows how to secure the mushroom. Uh-oh! Movement of one, though. Very close to runaway, bro. Hopefully he doesn't get it. And he does not get the early P-Speed here in 3-2. That's okay, man. It's a very, very tough P-Speed strategy. Not the easiest. All right, true Hyper Mario's turn to enter the 3-1. And Zikabee does get the mushroom, so he's going to get the Flower Star Mushroom cards. And he gets he gets to avoid he avoids the um the runaway road, which is really, really good. Really good. He's not in the clear yet, but he's like he, he definitely feels more comfortable with true hyper Mario getting a great hammer brother movement. It's gonna save a little bit of time on Zikabee here, especially uh, if he doesn't uh, have any slip-ups in this level because he's not waiting at the start anymore, right? Nice, doing a very good job as long as he doesn't go through any cheap cheap, and he doesn't. Looks like he's in the clear. No uh, coin ship here for either runner, which is very nice. Does Zikabee get door three? Zikabee does not get door three. It's very unfortunate, man. He w definitely wants to secure those points. Definitely wants to secure those points. Drive for Mario's turn at the 3-3. This level, we've seen this level get some people. We've seen this level. Ooh! Ooh, look out! What the? Ah! Okay, he's good. I, I know that's right. I, I knew he was going for the P-Switch. I need to add some uh, dramatic effects here. Which were not that dramatic. Alright, Zikabee. Hammer Brothers. Looking pretty good. He's going to avoid Runaway. And he's going to get the double combo. The no water battles and the special tiles, as it looks like, which is pretty good. And it looks like True Hyper is also going to be in the clear, guys. If True Hyper gets door three, this could be big, man. This could be really big. Ah, very, very close. Look at the green in the background of that room. Let's see what happens on Zikabee's side. He's going to go for the special point and run the risk of Runaway. He's going to run the risk of Runaway, which I don't think he's going to get it. Let's see here, though. Let's see here. Special item. Oh, no! And he gets the runaway, so he's going to use a cloud. Go across. Nice. And do level 7. However, if that hammer brother moves up into the right, Zikabee is in a very, very uncomfortable situation. So let's see how he deals with this. The runaway, bro, is a giant equalizer here. Alright, True Hyper Mario getting through. This could be a very, very nice catch-up on True Hyper's side. A very, very nice catch-up. True Hyper still needs to secure the Flower Star Mushroom, though. Very, very important for him to get that. The Hammer Brother does not go up. He's gonna wrap around and do the Fortress. True Hyper in the exact same situation. These guys are going crazy for the special tile here, man. They want the special tile. Let's see if True Hyper gets the exact same RNG here. And he does not get the same RNG. So it looks like he's in the clear. Neither runner 
getting water battle and both runners getting the special tile out of the way. He's going for the mushroom house though. And look at that. He already got the hammer though, so I don't understand what that was for. Right? I think he's backwards. I think he's confused. Right? Because the hammers are still between the two items. Yeah. He got confused there. All right. And just like that, look at this, guys. Zigubi still has his cloud, though. And True Hyper is not going to get the inventory. Right? The hammer is the first item in World 3, not the other way around. It's not Star Hammer. It's Hammer Star. So that confusion definitely has uh, cost them a little bit of time. And that definitely cost them two points right there. So hopefully, uh, so True Hyper needs it could be to mess up his inventory here. This is, uh, <laughs> this is crazy right now. Look at this. Oh my gosh. It's come. Battle of the H, guys. Battle of the H. Let's see. Oh, and Shriper just misses the H. You guys can see how damaging something like the H can be. Not massive, but enough. It's enough. Not massive, but it's definitely enough. Alright, there we go. Both on the airship. How are you guys doing today? How do you feel about that World 3, man? That was, uh... <laughs> that was pretty cool. That was a pretty intense World 3, man, with everything that happened. Runaway versus not runaway. Uh, very unfortunate for both of them. So could be getting a runaway true hyper forgetting which hammer brother gives the hammer versus star. So he is down two points, man. This is a chance for Zikabi to really get a good good thing here going. Um, but True Hyper does True Hyper doesn't have the uh, or no, sorry. True Hyper has the fire flower from the mushroom house, where Zikabi doesn't, but Zikabi has the flower star mushroom at the end cards, where True Hyper doesn't. So very interesting. doing great man I'm doing great I hope you guys are doing great as well world three airship let's go baby world three airship let's go baby world eight has definitely been one of the equalizers in this tournament that's for sure Oh, Zigabee misses, I think, just two shots, right? There you go, he's in the clear. Six, eight, ten, there you go. And look at these guys. Yeah, two hammers touched on Hyper's side, unfortunately. But Zigabee has an out-of-place cloud, right? Zigabee has an out-of-place cloud, so this could uh, mess up his inventory that he's not used to. You never know, man. Inventory is a funny, funny thing. Also, down a star as well. Down a star, cloud in a weird position. So, it be a very exciting. World 4 is the first world where a runner can get punished for not going fast. Alrighty then, let's go. Woo! Let's do it. World 4. Love World 4. And so it could be guess this piece of strategy. True Hyper Mario going for the shell strategy here. As long as they both get it, and as long as they're comfortable, and it looks like they are. And look at that, guys. Look at that. Boom. So we have to wait two more levels to see if True Hyper can start his flower star. There you go. There's a flower, but in the wrong spot. All right, right there. So it could be in True Hyper pretty much the, the cloud doing almost the same movement. True Hyper Mario with a very interesting Fire Flower strat there, man. Like, I always be afraid that the 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 fireballs will, like, get bonked on the, you know, the pipe or something. But it looks like pretty good, man. Looking pretty good. All right, Secret Beast Hammer Brothers do move back for him. Let's see what kind of movement he gets after this. Where True Hyper's moving away. This could be uh, pretty rough for both runners. All right, we want to see no punishments here from either runner. No punishments.
And look at that, ladies and gentlemen. No punishments. Look at that. No punish. Ooh, get some mushroom. Zikubi has clouds by clouds. However, True Mario does not have to worry too much about his inventory, right? He's gonna use his cloud right there. He's gonna go right for the P-Wing and he's going to get the P-Wing. Yes, he is. He's going to get the P-Wing. Remember, he had that extra cloud and using it early, getting out of the 4-4, which is the worst level in the world, man. Look at this piece of crap. Nobody likes... Oh, you see? This is an absolutely horrible level. He's gonna have to swim blind, though. Swimming blind, let's see. He almost gets sniped, man. 69 coins, though, so... His luck is definitely on his side. He's gonna go for the early P-Speed. Does he get the early P-Speed? He does not get the early P-Speed. He's not going back for it. True Hyper does not screen scroll. Oh no. Oh, he does get it though. Wow. Okay. I th They switched, man. I didn't even notice the switch. Wow. Alrighty then. He does get it. But he doesn't have to worry about his inventory. Zikabee does go to the Mushroom House. <gasps> Almost death right there for True Hyper. That could have been really bad. And Zikabee not getting the Fire Flower from the Mushroom House, but he does, he does get his items to go a little, uh, little skew there. Again, True Hyper Mario does not have to. So let's see if he gets the early P-Speed here. Very important. He's gonna go back and try it again. He's gonna go, yeah, definitely, man. It's about the points. Try again. You can do a little bit harder at a turn back. Does not get it. Is he gonna go back and try it again, though? He is not. He is not gonna go back and try it again. That is a very, very difficult P-Speed, guys. I don't blame him. Very, very difficult P-Speed. Although this is about the points, that definitely would have been a point that he got on it. That definitely would have been a point he would have been able to get there. But regardless, they're both doing great. And True Hyper does not have to worry about his inventory. This could be big, man. So it looks like he's maybe close to a minute behind, which is, <laughs> that's pretty good, man. That's still uh, getting all hands versus no hands kind of thing, right? This auto scroller is the worst. All right, let's go ahead and uh, read some support. Read some support if I got some. Looks like I do. Yo, got Helm back for five months. Thank you very much for five months. And Humiliation 91 with the two months. Thank you very much and welcome back, you two. I very, very much appreciate it. World 4 airship is very boring. That's why I got notifications to read and whatnot. Ooh, looking pretty good, man. Looking pretty good. don't want to see Jesus clip guys I don't want to see Jesus clip Jesus clip would ruin everyone's run I mean, it's a Jesus clip is a sure way uh, to lose <laughs> unless you're Stewie in which in that case Jesus clip will definitely help you out a lot all right so it could be the first to enter world five Let's go ahead and get to the second portion of our card here. We got Roulette 280 and no bumps. Very important. Anything can go. Let's see True Hyper Mario as long as he doesn't go through the boss. Which is by far the worst thing to happen. And he doesn't go through the boss. That is good. Doesn't lose his Fire Flower either. This is big. Mm-hmm. 
So interestingly enough, is Zikubi has, I think, no, he doesn't. He has the same. Ah, he's down a level or up a level. I don't know what, how that's gonna affect his his lives. I don't know how that's gonna affect his lives. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We shall see. All right, here we go. This is exciting. Is it gonna be gonna use a music box? Is he gonna get a P wing? I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Normally, a music box will be what happens here, right? He'll go. He'll come out of this pipe and then use a music box, right? No music box, but the Hammer Brothers did switch. No, 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 uh, no flower there. Very interesting setup for the flower, but I mean, these guys definitely know how to get flower more than I do. I've never been pushed in a situation where I have to get a flower, right? So, I mean, a flower has never been an objective at all in my life in this game, so. Taking nice and slow. He doesn't want to fall down the shaft, but he is going to have to speed it up here. He's in a music box and a star here. All right, no bumps in the overrun map. Does he get the 280? All about that 280, and then Chirai Bramaro now doing a very good job in 5-2. Cleaning it up, man. Cleaning it up. Ooh, almost. Almost. That might affect this 280, but I don't think so. I don't think that's gonna affect Zikabee's 280. No bump on Chirai for side either. 287, it looks like he's probably in the clear here. 282, 281, he is in the clear, so he is going to get the 280. He's not gonna do the roulette game, though. I wonder if this is gonna come down to inventory items, right? Boy, that would be unfortunate. All right, Hammer Brother Switch. I'm gonna go for the roulette game. Does he know the roulette game? Mushroom, mushroom. And he gets the mushroom! Wow, look at- oh, sorry. Oh, I did the wrong points, wrong side. There we go. Right on. Look at that fix. No overworld bumps for either one of them. Ooh, does take damage, so he's not gonna get that 280. Very unfortunate. He has to make sure he secures either the same points or more than what Zikubi has, right? Zikubi's not going for the roulette game. Which means getting 280 here would have would have been a big big advantage for him. All right, let's see how it goes. We will see how it goes. Drew Hyper still has the chance to get the one point advantage if he gets the Flower Star Mushroom, right? Nice, he could be getting the good RNG right there. The mother of all RNGs. Music, fuck me, music, fuck, 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 fuck. Right, here we go. Still no bumps on the overworld map for either of our runners. True Hyper getting a little nervous, I think. I think he's getting a little nervous here. He's gonna have to go. He's going a little bit slower, man. He's taking it easy. Nice, and Zigabee does great work on the fortress. These runners are not too far apart. Remember, it's about the points, right? Trying to get the points. And look at that, True Hyper avoids 88 coins. Just to make sure. Just to make sure. No overworld bumps. All right, here we go. Does the pipe rub so he can get P-Speed? Well, Zigabee also gets P-Speed in his level. These guys are the P-Speed masters. Ooh, the little fly there, that's a little slow down, but I think he's gonna use that to damage boost. In 5-7, and True Hyper just not getting a flower card as his first card. It's just not working for him. But as long as he keeps going. Alright, no bump on Zikubi's side, so it looks like he's going to get the double point. Looks like they're both going to get double points in this world. As long as True Hyper does not get an overworld bump. At that. All right, here we go. Let's get True Hyper Mario out of World 5 here. Let's get him out of World 5 here. He does get the runaway, which is... 
not the end of the world in world five. It's not the end of the world. All right, this fortress is very scary, guys. He's gonna opt out of P-Speed for consistency, which again, I don't think is a bad idea, right? There's two games. And look at the points right now. There are two games and look at the points. There you go. Comfy, comfy. Don't get the movement of four. Of course it does. Just, just to bleed even more time. All right, here we go. True Hyper Mario side is gonna go for the PC strategy. He does get it. Now, as long he can, he can still even lose Fire Flower here. He is, he is good. He is good. So it could be grabbing that one. All right, so True Hyper Mario is behind by um, a large margin. But again, we've seen this before. This isn't even the worst that we've seen before. This is still anyone's game right now. He's gonna use the cloud. And again, he does not have to worry about his inventory either. No bumps on the overworld map. He's gonna go for, oh my gosh, right under that hammer. Dude, when the nerves kick in, the brain starts thinking some weird things, right? You never know how, you, how you're gonna deal with it. And it looks like he does get no bumps on the overworld map right there. And look at that. Boom, 13 to 13. All right, Zigabee's gonna start start off his world six. He's gonna use his hammer. There you go. He gets a low pattern at the start. That's really good. Low pattern at the start. All right. He's gonna go for the fortress here. There it goes, looking good. He's gonna jump over the question block. The patented Zigabee strat. Oh, he makes that jump. That is gonna be a clear-cut chance for him to do the 279. There should be no reason why he doesn't get it here. Right, when you get that big jump from spikes to the pit without touching anything, that's a big time save. And right there, he gets the 279. Right there, that is the time save. That's the strategy that you wanna do. That is definitely the strategy that you wanna do. That's, um, that's, the, that's the very common uh, warpless speedrun strategy. So it's good to see him being able to bust it out in the tournament right runner other runners are using p wings for the consistency which is good while some runners are doing their their p speed strategies that they already they already know right it's really good i love the mix up right i love the mix up in strategies true hyper almost getting stunned there not getting stunned though so that's good as long as you're not getting stunned man you're in the clear all right here we go so it could be side with the p wings and his Looks like Zigabee is going to get the items, the item tile thing. So let's see how this goes. Boom, tail swipe. Does he get the despawn? Boom, now the tail swipe. He gets the despawn. Right on. Right on. I feel like the challenge of the despawn, it would be too much to have as a point, right? All right, it's true hyper Mario Sir and Zigabee as well. Is he gonna go for the hammer suit? He is gonna go for the hammer suit. True Hyper also needs to be looking for low patterns here. He needs anything other than Zikabi getting the opportunity here. Does he get a low pattern? He gets a low pattern. Now it's Zikabi's turn. Does Zikabi get a low pattern? He gets a low pattern. So it's all up to RNG on Zikabi's side here for low patterns versus high patterns. Let's see how this goes. True Hyper Mario entering the level as Fireflyer Mario. Zikabi gets bad RNG, but he's gonna use the music box, put him to sleep, and he's got the hammer, so he is going to get the low patterns. He is gonna get the low, oh, sorry, wrong side. He is gonna get the low bro. I did the wrong side again, there we go. Even it out, sorry guys. We are good. True Hyper Mario, not sure if he's gonna be able to get the 279. I don't think so. He's gonna have to clutch out some low patterns here. Still though, this still, this is crazy game, man. Crazy game. I got the track. Yeah, 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 I saw the trackers. I fixed it up all by myself. I did it all on my own. All right, here we go. True Hyper Mario on the scary level of the world. Any mistake in jump can result in big bad boo-boos. Gotta watch out for those big bad boo-boos, guys. Gotta watch out for those big bad boo-boos. All right, True Hyper finally getting the flower as his first inventory card. You love to see it, guys. You love to see it. 
Not gonna use an item. This could be very scary. He does get a low pattern though. But he takes the death, which means he's gonna have to get another low pattern. Come on, use a star. He does get another low pattern. Oh my goodness. Okay, there it is. Gonna have to take the death though. Very unfortunate. Does he get another low pattern though? That's... Wait, what item did he just get there? I think... I don't know, because he's in the clear, right? He's in the clear, so he could be going for the clip. Oh, and he gets it, but doesn't get it. Someone's got to get this clip, guys. Ooh, and true hyper taking damage here. I hope this isn't where his run starts to crumble, man. He doesn't need this crap, right? Nice, he does get that, though. All right, he's not out of the weeds yet, guys. Not the end of the world, man. It's about the points. True Hyper does have the flower. He's gonna wait. Yeah, right? I mean, at the same time, let's see. I want to see other people going up against the world. One of the world's best Mario 3 runners, right? I mean, he's doing a great job. And I'm just so proud of every runner in this tournament so far. All right, True Hyper gets the good RNG. We're gonna see if he had a, if he got the cloud in his inventory. He did get the right hammer, brother. So it looks like he does get all low patterns as well. Look at that, he's in the clear. He's in the clear. He is in the clear. There you go, you see? Coming back in clutch. Nice, he's gonna go for the tail flying strategy. Wow. Oh my gosh, almost bonks his head. Gotta take it a little calm, man. A little, a little more steady in that. All right, Zikabee going for the first clip. Does not get a first try. Goes for a second try. Does he get a second try? He gets it second try. And there you go. Almost getting a full World 6. However, True Hyper Mario is on his way. However, <sighs> dude, True Hyper did not get the Flower Star Mushroom, man. That is just not coming in clutch for him today. Very, very unfortunate point for him. Missing the grab block, grabs the leaf, and he's on on his way. We are on our way. All right, here we go. Boom, boom. Does he get the one up? He is going to go for the one up. But remember, you have to get under the 60 minute mark for it to count, so make sure you get it. And there we go. So it could be going for the sub pixel manipulation setup. True Hyper Mario on his way, gonna use a P-Wing, 6-9. I wanna see him get that Fire Flower, dude. Get that Fire Flower, bring it home, man. It's gonna be hard because you don't get a star from 7-1, so let's see how this goes. Ah, the Mushroom. It's okay, though, he still has a couple levels left. He's got some levels left, not many. I think he's got, like, 11, 10 levels left where he can get cards. All right, zikabee has got to go for first try clip right here. You got five tries, Zikabee. Let's see you get it. Come on, first try right there. One, two, three, four. Last try. Five, he gets it last try. Wow. The luck, dude. The luck, man. Gets it last try. That's not the first time we've seen that either. That is definitely not the first time we've seen that. We've seen many runners get it on the fifth try and we've seen runners get it first try so that is really really good that he can secure that point Ooh, missed the blocks it's good he's gonna have to go back because he doesn't have the extra star right doesn't have the extra star he looks like he is in the clear though all right true hyper mario making his way through the airship Somebody on the airship. Yo, it's Joey. Yo, it's Joey Jax with the five gift subs. Thank you very much. Um, I didn't miss it, but I don't do notifications in the middle of the races. However, True Hyper Mario is on the airship and Zika B is doing 7-3. So I got a little bit of time. Thank you very much. It's Joey Jax for the five gift subs. Supporting the tournament, man. He wants a season three. Very much appreciated. And Joey Jax also coming in clutch with a tier one sub of his own. Thank you very much. The double support. I really appreciate it. True Hyper Mario taking damage there. That is a very, very unfortunate thing there. He needs to clean up some of these extra points. Nice. He's going to be using a cloud here. Nice. 
Nice. He's gonna use the Tanuki here because all I think he might only have one P Wing left. I'm not too sure. Alright, true for Mario. One stomp, two stomp, three stomp, your stomp. Nice, dude. All right, we want to see a first try clip on True Hyper so we can just secure that point. No lifelines used yet, guys. No lifelines yet. All right, use the P-Wing. He's out of there. We are, we're, we're just in the item abuse levels right now. We're really focused on True Hyper Mario right now, trying to get this clip here. He's got five tries, man. He needs it. He needs to start ranking in some points. Well, seven here. All right. Here we go. First try! First try! Wow. First try right there. And look at that, ladies and gentlemen. They could be doing nice work on 7-8, annihilating it. He doesn't need hammer suit. Remember, guys, there's no reason to go for hammer suit unless it's for safety, right? Safety is the only reason, using his last P-Wing. Nice, and Zikubi, or sorry, True Hyper Mario getting his way through 7-2, which is another difficult level here in World 7. Very difficult level. Zikubi so going for the quick time saves for the extra clips here. He's not getting it, not working for him. Is he gonna go back up though? He, I think he was going to. There you go, he's going back up now. He's out of there, he's done with that. Enough clips today. Seven three. Seven three on true upper side. It could be first attempt, not working. Second attempt. The clips are not working for him right now. They are not working for him right now. True Hyper going a little bit too slow here in 7-3. Hopefully he doesn't take a death. Man, the hills in these spinies are a nightmare. Oh my goodness. Missing his jumps. I think he's getting a little nervous, right? That's 7-2. 7-1. Turned out really good. And he doesn't get the flower, man. I don't think he's going to get that card. That is a special card right there. All right, Zikabi is not going to do the fortress, or he is. He is going to do it. That's right. Okay. Nice. We've seen... There's a couple other people's Mars also did this same strategy. So it's... um. Looking really good for runners who, who like... Oh yeah, getting that P-Wing on True Hyper Mario's side. And see if we doing great work on the first room in this fortress. Gonna do the bonk, go under, and the double jump, and he is out of there. Very nice job. Nice. And he's going to use uh, what I presume is a music box, get past the, past the plant. And I think he's in the clear for no point, no items touching, right? Let's see. Yes, he is in the clear. Uh, yes, right there. There you go. Right on, True Hyper Mario. Not far behind. True Hyper Mario, I don't think he's going to get punished for the 60. He does have a lot of time. He does have a lot of time. This is actually a really, really good race. Alrighty. Gonna go for the very comfortable, consistent 7-7. Seven, seven. I like to see that. We have seen a good chunk of 7-7s seven, this tournament, haven't we? There you go, getting that star. Making sure he has enough time. Making sure he's got enough time. I think he wanted to take intentional damage there because you don't want to be doing this level with the leaf, right? The leaf is very, very slow. Nice, and he skips one of the stars. That's actually a really fun strategy. I remember doing that a very long time ago when we when 7-7 seven, seven was in Warpless. Um, very, very nice strat being able to skip that star. It's like a little speed run all in itself. A speed run. Inside of a speed run. Alright, here we go. It's a good chance for True Hyper to be able to clutch in some points right here. If he gets mid-clip, he'll gain another extra point, and it'll look pretty good, right? I, I mean... It look pretty good on on this part. Um. All right, here we go. This is it, True Hypes. This is it. Time to get a point. Oh, and he does the turn back. Very unfortunate. He doesn't want to go for P speed. P speed. It's easier to get the clip with P speed. I'm very surprised. 
to see a no P speed clip. Very surprised to see a no P speed clip. But he's getting. Oh, and there it is. Wrong one, my dude. Wrong one. Wrong clip. Oh, he got. Oh my gosh, he gets the flower card. No freaking way, dude. No freaking way. And Zigabee is working on the boss right now. Driver Mario is going to use Music Box Cloud, and he is out of there. There you go. Not too bad, guys. Not too bad. All right, we are in auto scroller land. So this gives me a chance to open up chat and ask you, how are you guys doing? How's it going, guys? How you doing? Yeah, he got the slow clip the first time in his first race. Good. Dude, True Hyper Mario is doing a fantastic job. And like I said before, I mean, you put yourself in his shoes, go up against one of the one of the better players, right, of Mario Brothers 3, and then there you have it. Can Zikabi still get sub-54? Um, I'll have to look at what his time is when he gets to the hands. See what his time is when he gets to the hands. I should get a world. Oh my god, that'd be so hard. Triper Mario is 100% still in the game. I mean, he's only down by what, five points right now? And he's got the flower card, and Zukubi already has that card, so. It's, uh. I've seen this kind of time difference before. <laughs> Driver Mario almost flubbing it around though, but he does get it. He does get it. No Wrangless on Zikubi's side here. No Wrangless. Wrangless is a very, very important, <clears throat> very, very important uh, item. Up on the overworld map. Not helping the sub 54 there. to get a 53-something. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright, Hyper Mario's turn to enter World 8 and do some damage here. Do some damage. I mean, there's a lot of points in World 8. A lot can happen. We've seen a lot happen. Did his music really not change in uh, the Hammer Brother battle? That must be some weird uh, music glitch. What is it, Royalty? What did we miss? The, the no change in music? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's the Navy Walk. That's the Navy Walk. Uh, I think that was invented by Cab Audio. For the any percent. Yeah, very, very old strategy. Yeah, 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 the moonwalk. It looks so silly, too. You're just walking in the air. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's a silly story. All right, here we go. Hands. We got more important things, guys. Hands. Let's go. Let's do the hands. See what he gets. No hands, right? Ah, oh, I guess pulled in by the first hand right there. Hand number one on Zikubi's side. Hand two. Does not get pulled in by hand two, so he got one hand. So this is looking pretty good for his time.
almost gets Wrangless on True Hyper's side. Zikavi going for the save the animals here. Pay very close attention. Save the animals. Oh, heck yeah, this is Super Metro. No Rocky kills. Right on. Right on. There we go. Wow. Drew Hyper almost taking damage there. Don't kill the Yoshis. Don't do it, you guys. Right, here we go. 8 1. 8 1's not the worst level. Going to get the 1 up right here. Ooh, almost takes the damage there. Very close. And he gets through. He needed that life right there, guys. He needed that life. Yeah, no, not the Karua death. He's good. He's good. All right, hammer suit time. He's gonna go for the sun. Get that sun kill. All right, true hyper. This is we got points all over the place right now. Gets the sun kill, and he is out of there. All right, true hyper. Gets the first hand. There's some points here that True Hyper can can still get here if he gets all three hands. He gets all three hands. This is probably going to be a sub 54 here. All right, hand number two. Is there a point for Bowser hit? No, no, no. There's a point if you get pulled up by all three hands. That is correct. <clears throat> All three hands from True Hyper. And there's a point right there. <clears throat> That's good, man. He needs points. He's got to get points, right? As long as he doesn't get the Rocky kills, man. As long as he doesn't take damage. He's going to use the Leaf for safety. Dude, True Hyper can get a lot, a lot of points in this world. Dude, I have a water. My throat's just being a stupid jerk right now. It's really annoying. But we're good. We're good. Oh my god. Very scary right there. Ah, Zikabee. I don't know if he gets it, though. I don't know. He's close. He's close. That inventory, man. That might have flubbed it. Why is he taking bottom route? Maybe he thinks that's his only opportunity. Maybe he thinks if he gets this. Oh, he's gotten out of there. He's like, I'm not dealing with this crap. And True Hyper gets the no wrenches. Gonna go for the other clip. Gonna go the other way around. So it looks like he's not going to get the sub 54. Wait, he would have messed up the, the one up there. Oh, I see why he did that. I see. I get it. Driver Mario very, very badly needs. All right, here we go. Zikabi in the finale, and he does it. He does it. He needs to get a P Wing or a star here. Needs to get a star, and Zikabee takes no damage, and that's it right there. That's his score. 22, almost with the 23, but True Hyper is not done yet. True Hyper is not done. He needs to get a... Oh, he gets a star! He can still get a lot of items here, man. This is a lot of items. All right, here we go. Got to equip the hammer suit. I get the sun kill. 
Does he get the sun kill? Nope, he's gonna have to wait for it. Does get the sun kill right there. 17, man. He does get second place though, so we gotta take the second place away. As long as he doesn't get the sub 60 and he gets the, the lives. As long as he doesn't get the sub 60. Ah, oh, man! Come on, that was a free point, man. The mushroom there. That is super, super duper unfortunate, man. That was right there for him. Got a star. He's gotta, he's gotta move fast here. He's gotta move fast, man. Waited way too long. Zigabee did get the lives. That's right. 23, he is tied. Yes, I won't miss the Zikabi. I'm trying to focus here on True Hyper, guys. Settle down. All right, he does make it one cycle, so he is in the clear. Dude, he had the mushroom. He had the mushroom right there. No overkill, that's good. I think he has enough time. Dude, I think he has enough time here. I think he has enough time. Any way to switch the audio? Yes, yes, guys, yes, we can switch the audio. Jesus. All right, he's got last auto scroller right here coming up. Last auto. Yes, yes, I'll put the audio. Okay, I'm closing chat. So, as long as True Hyper Mario does not. Like, as long as he doesn't autopilot getting the life, I think he's in the clear. I think he's in the clear for the sub 60. So, as long as he doesn't get punished, man, it's not the end of the world for points for him. Still has the hammer suit, so he hasn't taken damage yet either. Let's take damage yet either. And that would be the only point that he would have left. Dude, let's say, let's say he got... Okay, oh no, he's got the 20 lives. So... Man. And he took a death too, right? Alright, I think, I think he has this. Slow and steady, man. Slow and steady, and you won't get punished. Little, little overthrow. There we go. Got him. Nice. Okay. Dude, think about if he didn't die, got the inventory, got the flower, right? Oh my god. Alright, using the star. He's in there. Very, very nerve-wracking right here. Duck. Yup. Yeah, he knows the strats. Don't autopilot. He knows. And he gets the clip. Let's see if he does peace speed. He has a lot of time here. He has two minutes to take it nice and slow to get through Bowser's last throne room here. He's gonna take it nice and slow. There it is. That's what you need, man. That's how you get the points. Yep, he's gonna wait. And I think he's secured it here. There you go. And that's it. He did not take damage and he got 20 lives. Dude, think about if... Guys, if he got the flower, no items, and didn't die. Look at what his score would be. Very easy points right here. Well, the death is a little harder. But man, oh man. And right there. 18 on the clock. We'll double check, make sure I don't miss anything. But that is incredible. On go from three. Let's do this. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go! Let's do it, guys. We're gonna do True Hyper's audio right now. And the runners are off. Going for dope P Speed strategies in one one. Looks like they're going to do duck jump into the clouds. Zikabee is going to get his patented one up right there. And look at that. Done and done. Both getting a star. Both done the first level. Both looking good. We have game two up right now. Sorry, I was too busy talking with chat instead of editing here. Look at that. What do we have? Uh, 23 to 18. Let's do it. 23. We got 23 right here. 
versus 18 on Zikubi's side versus True Hyper Mario. Zikubi on the left, True Hyper Mario on the right. They both finishing 1-2. Gives us an opportunity to say, you have two points that you can get in World 1. Frame Perfect Jump in the Boomerang or slash Hammer Brother and doing the Duck Jump along the entire airship. Looking good, guys. Looking good. Alright. Wow, True Hyper Mario is really, really showing, man, that he can he can do this. He can definitely do this. I wonder if doing runs while not under this pressure and not getting points is going to cause him to actually start getting um, lower PBs now. This is interesting. And Zik could be getting the frame jump right away in World 1. Done and done. Right there. Ooh, getting his head stuck in the ceiling. That is going to be a time loss right there. He's going to have to get the mushroom back. In 1-6, Zikabi is going to go for the tunnel again for the swagness. Goes to the swag, gets the swag, the double swag. All right, True Hype, Ma True Hype Mario, you need to get the mushroom here. Do not forget about the mushroom. Do not forget. Nice, and he knows the backup. Just a little pop-off. Gravity, gravity, and get out of here. Nice, gets his P-Speed this time, where last time it flubbed him around. Oh my gosh, and he almost died right there. Very scary. Nice and nice. They're there in the clear. He's going to get the Fire Flower here. Is he going to get the Frame Perfect Jump? He does. Wow, these runners are crazy, man. Getting all of these tricks, dude. Going to go for the Mushroom again, man. Does he get the mushroom again? The fire flower right here. Wow, he gets it again, dude! Dude, now he does not have to go through any mushroom messes. All right, it's ducking strategy. Boom. Zikabi is on his way to ducking. Pretty good. These runners both, I feel like, know exactly how they should be doing the ducking. Watch for those peaks, guys. Oh, and True Hyper with the peak. That is not going to be good for him. That is not, that is a big point advantage. That's a big point swing. He knows this, he knows this. So he's gonna, he's gonna have to clean up some points here. Maybe he doesn't mess up his inventory this time. Uh, who knows, right? There, there's, um, there's lots of things that can happen here. Nice, gets the fire kill though. So not the end of the world, guys. We have seen worse. We have seen worse. Looking pretty snazzy. Alright, let's go ahead and switch over to Zikubi's audio here. Very nice work on 2 1 P speed. Everyone knows after you do 2 1, you always get a movement of 2. So they are in the clear here for the movements of 2. Here we go. Sliding strategy, get him out of there. No mode of tears either. No fanfares from either. I want to see no deaths and no fanfares from either runner. Moving to two. Right for Mario's side. All right, now the doorway has opened up there in World 2 and things are heating up right now. Does not make that jump, but that's okay. He gets out of the quicksand very fast, man. Very fast. That's good. That's a good thing. It could be not getting early P speed this time, which is okay because he does get the backup P speed. Let's get the backup P speed. Here we go, seven to six, game two. Oh, True Hyper trying to go for his own, his own early P speed, but he also gets the backup as well. So not the end of the world, man. They're very close. They were kind of in this situation last time. 
but they were definitely tied in points more or less it could be is going for the music box again here nails it guys i'm so in tune with this race like i'm so focused i'm so focused here I don't want to miss anything. There's so much that can happen right now. Movement of one on Zikopi's side as an example of something that can happen. True Hyper still getting movements of two, man. He's still getting movements of two. Nice, and look at that. True Hyper Mario is not going to lose a billion seconds here in 2-3. Uh, You can already see a big difference in run. Neither runner getting the flower card. Neither runner getting the flower card. Still, movements of two on Hyper Mario's side. This is crazy. Zikubi has already gotten movements of one, so this movement of two can be really big. Does get the sun kill both sides. Double sun kill. Oh, wrong order, True Hyper. Wrong order. It's okay, though. That's another movement of two. I can't believe he's still getting movements of two. However, the movements of two normally die down at the end of World 2. Right? You get the hammer that's doing movements of two. Leave it up to the... Uh... Dude, unless it moves into the castle, that would actually be pretty good for him. That would be pretty good for him. It does move into the castle. Oh my gosh, this could be big. Nice, it could be going for the mushroom house here. He does not get the fire flowers. It's not, the mushroom houses are just not working for him at all. Meanwhile, True Hyper Mario in the pyramid doing great work, dude. He is doing much better than he did last run. Zikubi, I'd say, is doing pretty close to the same. He's doing a little bit better since uh, he did not take damage on the Boom Boom like he did round one. And True Hyper getting Flower Card as his first card. I just want to say, finally! All right, another movement of two right here. Here's his chance. If he gets one more movement of two, he needs the Mushroom House with the Hammer Brother and the Warp Whistle. So let's see what happens. Zikubi also getting a Fire Flower. Does True Hyper Mario get a movement of two? He does not get a movement of two, that's unfortunate, but he does take the lead in time. Wow, look at these runners right here. That's, uh, that's pretty intense, man. Look at that. I don't even know what to say. Don't even know what to say. I mean, we got to give True Hyper the audio, right? He's in first. I mean, there might be a little bit of desync with the with the audios or whatever. Or sorry, with the uh, with the timers. Yo, guys, how do you feel about this race so far? What the heck, man? This is so good. No lifelines yet. Fire kill versus not fire kill. And that's it. Fire kill versus not fire kill. Zigabi takes that one second lead back right there. And there it is. That's how that is the power of fire kills, guys. Right there. Alright, world three, man. World three is when things get very, very interesting. And I mean very interesting. There we go. They both have flower cards too. And uh, Hyper Mario still has the flower card from uh, the Mushroom House too. And I don't think Zikubi is really going to be doing many more Mushroom Houses for it. A couple more uh, to wash out. 
He's gonna do a couple more to wash out his uh, inventory. But I think that's where he he tries to get his uh, his flower cards from. And True Hyper could make another mistake here again, depending on what happens. Oh my gosh! Run straight at the card, True Hyper. Oh, that's so close, man. Nice, Zigabi gets the P-Speed. True Hyper Mario knock over the P-Speed strategy, but that's okay, we have seen before. It has worked in his favor. And look at the comfort on him. Look at him, he's right through. It really didn't save that much time. And Zigabi does get the Flower Star Mushroom right there. Zigabi does get the Flower Star Mushroom right there. Ooh, Zigabi not in the clear yet. True Hyper getting uh, Star, or sorry, Flower Mushroom Mushroom. That's not what he's looking for. Now he's going to get the frog suit. This is where this is where he messed up last time, but now he's in the clear, which is good to see, man. The inventory. That is good. Alright. They both gotta do good work for this right here. Very nice on Wow, true hyper is killing it. Zikubi with the runaway again! Zikubi with a second runaway, two runaways in a bro. Something is telling true hyper. Oh, he gets door three, though. He gets door three. Big points, man. He's clutching all the points. And True Hyper gets the flower card. Wow, man. We're getting the points here. The points are happening. True Hyper getting better RNG here with the Hammer Brothers. And that Hammer Brother not coming back for Zikubi, unfortunately. Go for door three. True Hyper side. He does not get the door three. Dang. Door three is a cruel mistress. You never know. You never know. Anything can go here. Mario 3 races are, are all over the place. Zigabee's gonna get the special tile right here. Yes, he is. Gonna get the special tile right there. Oh, he didn't he didn't activate it. There he goes. He activated it. Alright, it's true hyper's turn. The hammer brother does not run back for Zikabee. Uses his cloud. Going to put himself in the exact same position as before. However, True Hyper Mario is not. What the heck? Hyper, you run straight into the cards for the star. Why is Hyper Mario not doing the. Everyone knows. Nine billion people in the world know. He runs straight at the card for the star. That's okay, that's okay. He's got lots more cards left. He's got lots of cards left. Not lots of cards left. He's gonna get the special tile and no water battle as well. He's gonna get the special tile and no water battle. So that's good. That's that's good for him. Alright. And he has now taken the lead by not getting runaway, bro. Look at that. Don't get a fanfare here though. Man, if he this run would be mocking him, dude. If he got oh my gosh, right? Like, what a jerk this run. If he gets a fanfare here with flowers, the flowers are just taunting him at this point. It's okay, it, it, dude, it's okay to make those mistakes, right? I mean, you're not always gonna get the star. There you go, see, he knows. He knows, he's got it. All right, and that hammer brother ran back. Now look at this race, you guys. Does he get the ace jump? Oh, he almost gets the ace jump, but he has a little bit of a fumble, which is okay, though. He has time. Zikabi does have the extra cloud still, though, right? He does have the extra cloud. This would be very interesting. Here we go. Here's the difference right here. Boom, and he's out of that world, and he is in the lead. And Zigabee gets the H jump, so he is gonna lessen the gap right there with the H jump. Very, very important to get that H jump, man. As you can see, True Hyper Mario not getting the H jump, trying to grab all those white blocks. The grab blocks not working in his favor. Misses one here, misses one there, right? It happens. That's, that's what makes it so scary. It's lagging a little bit, losing a little bit of time there. But, uh, no, he nails it here. 
Zikopi definitely nails it. Get that ace jump. Let's go. Whoop. All right. Let's get no buffers here. No buffers. I am not. I am not dropping frames here. So that's good. As long as I'm not dropping no frames. All right, they're both on the auto scroller. How you guys doing? How are you guys doing? Yes, Zigabee got a full clear there. How are you guys doing? If you if if you do what Zigabee just did there, the best places to use that cloud would be um four four five two and um even that fortress that he did in in world three so four four five two uh world three fortress two or the two fortresses at the end of the game so seven port two and eight four right that's where you'd use the two clouds no it would not be world six not be world six. Four, four four is a great level the cloud mainly because it's just like a scary you'll take damage you can control your inventory better uh, you can make sure you get the P-Wing after the, the star, right? There's lots of, lots of stuff there. Alright, here we go. World 4. First world where people can get punished. Alright, let's see what kind of lead True Hyper Mario has. It's a it's a pretty decent lead, but again, like I said, Zikabi does have the cloud. So even if Zikabi clouded right here, he would have taken the lead. So we have to we have to really see how things are gonna go from here on out. Zikabi getting his P speed there. Oh my gosh! And True Hyper Mario almost running right into that piranha plant. That was scary, man. That was really scary. But nice work. Nice work for both of them. And here we go. I'm nervous to see how this goes, man. All right, Zikabee's so turn at 4-2. All right, here we go. True Hyper in the punishment realm. He didn't get punished last time. I don't think he's going to get punished this time. Ooh, unless you get Sticky Hill. That's why I always side jump off that one beetle. So I avoid that hill. That's right. All right, here we go. So true Hyper Mario really has to make sure he does 4-4 four, four fast. He's got to do 4-4 four, four fast because that's where true Hi or that's where Zikabee is most likely going to be using. Nice. Yep. Get the hammer out of the way. See how Zikabee did the side jump on the beetle? That's why we do the side jump on the beetle so we don't jump into the hill. Zikabee also not getting punished. All right, true Hyper has to. Has to go fast here. That's okay. That walking slow. He's got to wait for the Lakitu. That's right. All right. He's at the top here He's gonna use the hammer We get the cloud. Oh my god time's running out and it looks like Zigabee's just gonna take the lead by a little bit Oh, and true hyper takes the hit And Zigabee gets the exact same pattern as last time Incredibly lucky man Zikabee so far has been the luckiest person in the tournament. Hands down so far. That is just incredible. That pattern right there where you can see True Hyper not getting as lucky there. He's going to have to do some stuff. But in World 4 getting both the exact same patterns. And, I mean, that's incredible. Minus the two runaway bros for Zikabee. That is extremely unfortunate. But that kind of luck is not... I don't know. Getting lucky with points is more lucky than getting unlucky with uh, Runaway Bro, at least at least from my opinion. Let's see if he gets the early P-Speed. He does get the early P-Speed. Boom, he smashes it out right there. Early P-Speed done. Let's see if True Hyper Mario, True Hyper Mario needs to get this early P-Speed. Ah, uh, go back for it. Ah, uh, he should go, he should definitely go back for it. This is the, this is where he starts bleeding points. He should definitely go back. But that's okay, that's the end of the world. 
Think if he's gonna go for the mushroom mess, maybe he gets the flower? From the mushroom mess, does he get the flower? He does not get the flower. Very unfortunate. Well, I can say Zigabee's not definitely not getting lucky with the mushroom houses though, so that's a that's a much bigger thing. And there is true hyper Mario. He's going to get the P-Wing, and then he's going to have to grab what is it? Something. The mushroom house here, or the mushroom house is somewhere else. Ooh, gets the star. Not a bad idea. Not a bad idea. This is definitely faster than the mushroom house. Definitely faster than the mushroom house. Boom. Wow, a much, much closer race. Look at this, guys. This is insane. This is really good. Look at that. Well, I mean, he still has a lot of points. There's just a couple. There's just like there's only a couple that he's missed, right? Only a couple. Let's go ahead and go to the world five. It's part of the card. Lots of different stuff here. Lots of different stuff to be had. Oh, this tournament race is crazy. So much stuff is going on. And I mean so much friggin' stuff, guys. Now, if we could just not be on this boring airship. Hey, Mario 3, three hours, not bad. Alright, there we go. Let's go. It's one stop. Two stop. There we go. Yeah, a point on this airship to keep us awake. Now you're thinking outside of the box. Now you're thinking outside of the box. All right, you're right, Mario's turn. Don't go inside the boss, man. That is the worst thing. He's gonna go for the fire kill, though. All right, he makes it, though. He's good. Wow. That boss almost, man. He almost did what we all fear he's gonna do. All right, here we go. World 5. No bumps on the overworld map, man. We don't, we don't want to see any bumps. We want to see nothing. No coin ships, no bumps. I am surprised we've only, what, seen one coin ship? Have we only seen one coin ship this entire tournament? This entire tournament, we've only seen one coin ship. I'm just way too surprised on that. All right, 5-2 on Ziggy side. Meanwhile, Trey Mario, not that far behind, man. This is a much more uh, close race here. No shaft of shame on Ziggy side. True Hyper making sure he nails these stair strats. And he is out of there. Let's friggin' go. Ooh, not getting that flower. Just not working for him, man. These end level cards for Hyper Mario's just not working. Alright, movement of one. They're both probably looking for the P Wings here. No overworld bumps. And music box, okay. Nice, true. Right, Mario making it through. He's gonna use the P sliding strats. Boom! Really fast, and Zigabee absolutely annihilating the fortress. One, two, three, four, five. All it takes is five shots on the boom boom to destroy him. Get those orbs out. Orb. All right, here we go. No bumps in the overworld map, right? No bumps on the overall map. He's gonna use the star, and he is in there. He's gonna go for that 280. Got it last time. He's gonna get it this time. Here we 
go. And look at True Hyper Mario absolutely annihilating the fortress the exact same way. Boom, very nice. Alright, he gets the movement of two. Alright, he's gonna go for the roulette game. This is where he gets the points. Mushroom. 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 Wow, he knows how to play that game. Man, he knows he knows exactly how to play that game. And he annihilates it. Meanwhile, Zikabee also gets the 280 and he is in there. Bada boom. There it is. Gets the star. Not exactly what he wanted, I think. I think he wanted the P-Wing. Is he gonna go back for it? No, he's not. He does not even need it. Not gonna use the star either. Go for that 280. Should be using that star. He got an extra star. Use the star. That's okay, though. That's okay. Almost builds his P-Speed back. I don't know. Man, I don't think the 280 is possible here. We'll see, though. It's looking good. It's not the end of the world. Gonna have to build it back quick here. Oh, uh, he does build it back. He misses the pipe, though. I think this could be it, man. Nice. Is it gonna be getting this... This guy early, that's pretty good. No bumps on the overall map on Zigbee's side either. True Hyper's not gonna get that 280 right there. Very unfortunate, he needs it. But again, these runners are still very, very close. Oh man, 5-4 is super duper scary. Nice, he nails it though. He nails it. Both of these runners have to do a great job in World 5 so far. They both have, I think they both made sure that World 5 was not the scary world. In the pipe he goes. The fortress, another very scary level. Ooh, missing the pipe, that's okay though, he gets in. True Hyper Mario gets the jump. Man, that jump is super scary if you don't get P-Speed early. For some reason, sometimes you don't get a full big jump. There he goes, he gets the flower, dude. Yes! Yes, he gets the flower. That's what I'm talking about. No bumps on either runner so far yet. Ooh, and True Hyper doesn't actually need to fight this Hammer Brother, so if he can skip him, that'll bring him back just a little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> All right. Star, run right into the card. There it is. Done. No bumps on Zigabee's side. The bumpless. The bumpless. Dry for Mario does get to skip this. No! Maybe he uses it for a backup. Maybe he's using it for a backup, right? Because he didn't use the music box in World 4 or in World 5, so he still has one. So now he has two. Maybe inventory, guys. Maybe inventory. Double checking his inventory right there. Not bad. Not going for the P-Speed strategies in the Fortress, which, again, last time he did the same thing and it didn't cost him, right? It didn't cost him, he was fine. See, just like that, he's in the clear. Sometimes it's slow and steady, man. If you're not comfortable, if you're not feeling good about it, take it easy, right? It's way worse going faster and uncomfortable and then dying and then doing it again, right? And losing the points. Go level eight. Still no bumps. Nice P speed work right here. Very nice P speed work. There we go. True Hyper Mario. Star or Flower Star Mushroom right there for him. He does secure it. Boom. And there it is. There it is, we're coming in hot for World 6 right here. He also gets no bump on the overworld map. There you go, he's catching up with some points, man. He's getting some points back. He's getting some points back. Very nice. I love it, I love it. All right, he's on the airship. Meanwhile, Zigabee is making his way into World 6. And how is this going to play out? 
Nice, getting the fire flower. Stomping on some balls first. Use his hammer. He's in there. Gets a low pattern again. Zigabee has still only gotten low patterns in his last two races. Let's see how this works out. Definitely was not a marathon. I think that was just a movement of one. Gonna go for that. Gonna go for that 279. He does get the jump right over and into the pit. This should secure it. And with the 281 on the clock, I think that does secure it. That does secure it. He does get the point right there. Ooh, wrong person. Boom. Right there. Don't get stunned! Oh! Oh my gosh, that was so scary. That was way too close. Way too close. Oh, is he gonna be falling down? He's okay though. He got lag jumped. He's gonna go for this one up though. For the hell of it, getting the one up. Alright, he's on his way now. He's on his way. Oh, okay, that was scary, man. So what happened is he went to jump, but the game was lagging so much that um, when he was able to actually press jump wasn't actually when he was able to press jump. I think it had to do with running over the little pit there. Alright, going for the P-Wing. Meanwhile, True Hyper Mario is on his way too. Let's get a good look at their inventory. Uh, I've been paying attention very closely. Their inventory has seemed very good on their parts. Let's see if he gets low pattern. He also gets low pattern. This could be pretty big. If he just goes ahead and takes damage and kills him, he might use a P-Wing here. I don't know if he's got an extra one, but he might use a P-Wing here. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Let's see how it goes. He did get low pattern, though. He's going to use a P-Wing. This might give him the opportunity he needs, man. He needs, uh, he needs to get some points. He needs to get some of the same points that Zikabi is also getting. And then some. He, he flew a little too much there. And the wall rub, that is not going to give him the 279. That's okay. Not the end of the world. Zigabee again getting lucky. Again getting double lucky in World 6. Never even seen that before. The kind of luck. He's gotten four low patterns in a row and the Hammer Brother also not in his way in a row. Incredible. No runner has ever gotten that yet this tournament. Two games in a row. A massive amount of luck. Even World 4. He got the exact same patterns in World 4 and in World 6. Incredible. Very, very hard to compete with that kind of luck, guys. Very hard to compete. But he's ahead in time, so there's a lot of skill involved, too. You can't take away the skill, right? You're a good player. You're a good player. This is all there is to it. And uh, let's take a minute and look at True Hyper Mario as well. Right? Like, I mean, look where he is. He's nailing these strategies. Okay, that's not the Hammer Brother he needs, but he's got the extra music box. Oh, he didn't use it. And he does get the up pattern. See? He can't secure those points if he doesn't get as lucky. But he does get the special tile. Look at that. Special tile. So it could be annihilating 6-8 on his way to P-Wing land. Oh! Is he gonna go for the clip? He's gotta save that P-Wing? Wonder what's happening here. Is he gonna do it for the clip? Does it, Has he learned it? No? Okay, okay. He's good. He's gonna do the wraparound, which is perfectly fine. That's what uh, most runners would probably do. There is a clip inside there, but it's very awkward and weird. That's right. Very awkward and very weird. Ding, 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 ding. All right, here he goes. All right, he flies up. All right, Zikabee, come on. You gotta be the person to get this clip. You got it last time, but you got bad RNG. Get it this time, man. Lots of points. Ah, he does not get it. That's okay, though. Okay, that just means no one's got it yet. That's all. That's all that that means. Right? Alright, True Hyper going to the Mushroom Mess. does want that Hammer Suit. That is a very, very important thing to do. And it looks like True Hyper is not going to be punished by inventory points here. I think he's going to have it settled and figured out by the time he reaches World 7. I, I think we're going to see him get the, the two points this time. He could be using the Mushroom. And he's now on the airship. Zikabee's card is absolutely disgusting right now. See how it goes though, we'll see how it goes. Still, still lots of games left. And remember, there is still career total when it comes to points, right? Everyone 
Everyone, no matter if you win or lose, you still want to get as many points as you can because future seizing, future seeding in future seasons will definitely depend on um, what your max points are, how many games you won, you know, that kind of stuff, right? Because there's a lot of points to be dished out. Every season's different, right? So each season is a good representation with points about how well you do with lots of different things on the go. All right, second try for Zikabi. Does not get a second try. That's okay. He got it last time. He doesn't get it this time. True Hyper Mario using the damage boost strats does get the H jump and he is out of there. He hasn't died yet, right? So he doesn't need to get that one up on the H that he got last time. Remember, he got he stopped and got the one up that's above the H there. And that makes sense. He hasn't died. So he he's in control of his lives right now. Alright, now he's on. Oh, accidentally using the star. That's okay, though. Stars are definitely... Oh, maybe he was using it so that the items didn't touch? Yeah, I don't think that was accidentally, but that's okay. Alright. True Hyper. Is he gonna go for it here? That's the question. Alright, I'm so into this. Come on, someone get it. I want it to be True Hyper. I want it to be anyone. Oh, nice try though. Nice try. Hey man, you go for it. You either get it, you don't. You know, most of the time, the world record runners don't even go for it, right? There's no... It's, there's no benefit. You take damage and you, that's it, right? It's, it's a horrible time loss. You can't afford it. Alright, five tries. One. Two. Three. Four. Last try. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. He does get it, but he's not going to get the points there. Not going to get the points. He doesn't get the fire clip, and he doesn't get the 7-1. He's got mid clip left. He's got mid clip left. All right. True Hyper. You get this clip. You get this fire clip right here, man. You need it. You need to get some points here. Need to get some points here. Hard to get it's hard to get sick and tired of Mario 3 music, right? Nice work on 7-2. Oh, and he gets a first try! I made him get it. I forced him to get it. I forced him to get it. Oh yeah. I don't want to say that was me or anything, but pretty sure that was all me. Pretty sure that was all me. You're welcome. You're welcome, buddies. You're welcome. Alright, Zikabi is on the 7-3 right now. Don't imagine he's really going to have many problems with the 7-3. There's um, a lot of consistencies with 7-3. A lot of full big jumps. Uh, a lot of small jumps to kind of make it, you know, pretty, pretty uh, consistent, I'd say. All right, true hyper. There you go. He moved. Oh, he moved again, but he did move again. So let's see how this goes. Zikabi does have the two P-Wings this time. Is he going to 7-9 P-Wing? I don't know. What's he going to do? Oh, he's going to P-Wing there. He's going to use the leaf here. P-Wing later. All right. Here we go. Here we go. He's on the item abuse islands right now. Meanwhile, True Heart Mario's just about to start his 7-1 adventure. Now let's see how it goes. He's got five tries, man. Finger on the trigger. Five tries. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Got two more. Four. Last one. Ah, oh, and he does not get it. That's unfortunate. Six. Seven. He's switching it up. Eight. He gets it. He gets it on the eight. Not getting the point over that's not the end of the world. Oh, he did definitely did not want that star card. All right, so it could be now entering the seven eight. Gonna do the damage boost strat. Grab the star. Very nice. 
What? No frog suit, true hyper? You don't want a frog suit seven two? Come on, man. Frog suit makes it easier. Frog suit will not make it easier, and he would lose a lot of time if he frog suit guys. Oh, he's gonna have to go back. Does he know there's a fire flower right there? He does. That is good. He's gonna shoot that guy out of the way. He's gonna rebuild his P speed. Not a bad idea, guys. It's really, really not a bad idea. Right? A lot of people might look at some of these slowdowns and be like, what is he doing? Right? No, he's doing the right thing for sure. Gotta put yourself in their shoes, you know? All right, mid clip for Zikabee. Didn't get it last time. He's gonna get it this time, right? And he does get it this time. First try, mid clip right there. Making up for that seven. All right, making up for that seven one right there. Oh, True Hyper does not get the fanfare. That is good, man. A breath of fresh air right there. Seven three is True Hyper Mario's. N it's not his friend at all. There you go. Zikabee makes it. He gets out of there. He makes it. They're very scary, but he makes it. And there you go. He's out of there. A little flip flaps, right? Little little left right left right's going on there. But he's uh he's in the clear. So I think we're gonna he's gonna open up his inventory, and I think he's gonna be in the clear here. I think he's gonna be in the clear here. He is in the clear. He gets the no item touch. And there it is. It's all about the world eight right now. We're gonna get True Hyper Mario. True Hyper Mario is further ahead than he was last time, so he's not as uh, in a more he's not in as nerve wracking as he was before. Nice. And Zikabi is going to go for the two power ups on the airship. Still scary, but I think he will be fine. He should be good. All right, use the P-Wing. Item abuse land. I don't want to say I want to see someone die on the World 7 airship, but it would be really interesting, wouldn't it, guys? Because you'd have to go back across the Piranha Plant, which it would still be... Ooh, nice 7-7. Seven, seven. The Piranha Plant would still be asleep, I'm pretty sure, right? But it would just be weird to see. Um... All right, taking, doing a much faster approach here at 7-7. Very nice. And Zikabi getting his Fire Flower. Definitely probably feeling a little bit more comfortable now. He was probably comfortable with the Mushroom, but Small Mario is just a little scary. True Hyper has to get this star here. Yes, okay, good. He knows. He knows his backups, man. I love I love seeing runners either make mistakes or do something out of their comfort zone and, and either showing that it's happened before and know how to fix it. Or just on the fly making an amazing decision. Alright, here we go, True Hyper Mario. He's gonna get the Fire Flower. He needs to get the mid clip this time. Get some points, man. Get those career totals. Right, here we go, mid clip. Ah, oh, misses his jump. He's gonna go for the no P speed mid clip again. He does not get it. That's two attempts right there. And just like last time, Zikabi answers World 8 while True Hyper Mario gets on the airship for World 7. Very nice. You love to see it. All right, now I can open up chat since we are in auto-scroller land. How are you guys feeling about this? How do you guys using his stars? He is not in the clear, though. He's got a lot of stars he's got to get through. Got a lot of stars he's got to get through. All right, world eight time. be spent well i mean what do you expect i mean this guy speed runs this game pretty much for a living right i mean he's a he's been non-stop speed running this game for i think two years now right and he's got he's got records he practices and plays a lot right so he is one of the people 
that in this tournament, other runners are going to be afraid of facing up against, right? Um, so it's going to be very, very hard to take him down. This is his game. This is his primary and main speed game. But I would like someone like True Hyper Mario to take a look at how well he did up against Zikubi so far and really, really grind out some practice within the next couple months. And I want to see him come back for Season 3. I don't want to say he's completely out of it right now, but it's not looking very promising, right? It, like, something crazy, like a console crash or something on Zikubi's side. Even then, it could still be very hard. Exactly. I mean, I, if I was in a tournament and I was in first place, I mean, I mean, you can't be that impressed, right? I mean, it's not that... It's like expected, right? So it's like, we've really got to look between the lines at some of these other runners and go give them a follow on Twitch. Go and support them. Go, go in and encourage some of these other runners to get better so we can get even crazier tournaments in the future, right? I'm a piece of garbage, so don't worry about me. I'm not like that piece of garbage, but... I'm not in the tournament, so you guys don't have to worry about worry about this. And he does not get Rangless. <laughs> Mars. Yeah, he's gonna be using a warp whistle would be extremely unfortunate for him. So True Hyper Mario might actually be a little bit further behind Zikubi than before, but they are both in a different time bracket. They are both further ahead than they were before. Mario items have not touched, no. But he is, he is in a position where they still can, if he's not focusing. Oh, True Hyper Mario has definitely won our hearts with this. He is doing so freaking well. And against one of the world's best, right? Like, what? What? I, you know, I want to see these guys not stop practicing this game. Dude, dump those stars. Well, I mean, they're all going to try, right? I mean, they're all trying. They all get credit for trying. They get featured. You know, stuff like that. Exactly. Round one races have been really, really good. And even round two races. I mean, it's... All right, here we go. We got hands. And number one. There's only one person good enough to get two no hands in a row, and that's Scarface. Scarface Nico, he's the only one. And number two. Jealous? Of course I'm jealous. Did I cry myself to sleep every night wishing I could get no hands? Ah, uh, he quit out of the tournament. Oh, Zikubi gets all three hands! That's another point that might help him record points here. Yeah, he quit out of the tournament right before his race, but whatever. I don't really care. He wants to join in next season, sure. <gasps> no Wrangless on Mario's side. Whatever though, it's not the end of the world. Alright, save the animals. animals, man. Save them. Does anyone know exactly how long the Navy is? I never know. Yes, Kako dropped out. Alright, he has not killed one. It looks like he's going to get it. And he is going to get the no Rockies. 
This could be a brand new PB for the Zix. This could be a brand new PB. I'm not sure what record you're re you're referring to, Relayer. There's no one, no one here is gonna beat like the world record in this game, and there's there isn't really world record points. I, well, I mean, I guess if you guys want to make up your own like world record point thing, you guys can do that. That's cool. Whatever. But a boom! Peace be strategy's done, and Tri for Mario is off the Navy. Now it is his time. His time to cross the hands. So he could be going to equip the hammer suit. Let's go. Let's see what kind of hands we're getting on Shrek Mario's side. Hand number one. Ooh, Sticky Beat did not turn around. Oh my god, the little flubs, but he does get it. He does get the sun kill. Whoa. We have seen that same mistake happen before, man, and it is scary. He has not taken damage yet. If he duck jumps, though, it be okay. Remember, he's on hills with hammer suit. He can duck jump. Oh, and True Hyper takes damage. He's not going to be able to get that no damage point. Very unfortunate. All three hands from both of them. What the heck is this RNG, man? Boo! Boo, RNG! I mean, that's that's good getting a point, but boo! Boo! <laughs> no, Zikabee's on his way to get... 25 points. He's on his way to get 25. Sorry about that, guys. Ah, uh, not looking like- no, not- not a sub-54. Can't get that. Alright, save the animals on True Hyper Mario's side. What's the most point? I don't, I'm, I don't know. There's season one and season two, right? And there's gonna be multiple seasons after. So I don't know what the, what the points are. I think this is going to be the fastest points run. And True Hyper does get the point. His career total is going to be happy with that. Well, Runaway Bro doesn't really affect your points, so Runaway Bro is not really a, a factor in points having more or less, right? Runaway Bro is more time, not points. If anything, Runaway Bro helps you get more points because you don't have a water battle potential. Alright, Zikabee. Come on, man! Clutch it out, Zikabee! You got this! Do it! Come on, he's got the 20 lives. That's right. Nice! 20 lives, no damage, 25 points right there for Zikabe! Someone's been practicing, I told you guys from the very start, the person who practices the most is gonna be the person who does the best. Ooh, wow, right through there. Alright, but we still have... We still have another runner, guys. Alright, here goes True Hyper Mario. Let's get him these points. He did take damage though, so he cannot get the no damage. He's gonna use hammer suit. Use the star, he's good. It looks like he's got the no same item touch. He is in the clear. As long as he doesn't get the punishment, he's got lots of time. He does get the sun. There's another one right there. This could be this could be a PB in points right here. He is gonna have to take the second place though, so you you don't get two points for, for second place, you only get one point. Yes, GG for Zikubi. Looks like he is going to advance. He's going to advance into the next round. What does he have? 23 plus 25. Wow. Is that 48 points? Keep it going. Use that star. Yeah, nice and slow. I like it. Do 
Alright, get the one cycle, man. Get the one cycle. He needs to not autopilot his lives here as well, and then he can get more points. Nice. But he did take damage, so the, there's only one point left he can get. That's the 20 lives. Nice. Very nice. He knows the strat. You can stand inside the boom boom. Yeah, I want to see Zikabee get the 50, man. I want to see him get the 50. Yes, but you don't get punished for fighting the hand stages, because the hand stages give you leaves, right? So if you get two hands in a row, and then you have two leaves in your inventory, that's- Ooh. That should be fine, I think? Dude, double 18 is pretty hot, man. Talk about consistency, right? Yeah, yeah, fake Jesse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want people to get punished for having to fight hands and then getting screwed over again in inventory. That's unfair. Come on, Trihyper, you have enough time to get these lives. He, uh, he also has a Fire Flower, too. Yeah, the, the hand levels always give you the, the leaves, yes. Here we go. He he has more than enough time, man. He has more than enough time to go in and clutch this life's this lives point. Yep. Yeah, don't equip that frog suit. Nice, gets the clip. We need to make sure he doesn't autopilot the the one up here. Nice, he did not, man. He is definitely well aware of what's going on. Dude, yeah, he did a fantastic job, man. 18 and 18, man. That's way more than he got in his first race. So he's definitely been practicing, man. He's definitely been practicing. I love this, man. I love it from both runners. Dude, everyone's just doing so well, man. I'm just so proud of everyone coming out here and doing their hardest, man. I want to see everyone come back for Season 3 with more money as the prize pool, right? All right, Mrs. Fireball. He's got this, though. Slow strat. He might have to move out of the way of Bowser here. This is gonna get- yes, he does. He knows his strats, man. Talk about this is- hopefully Bowser doesn't go on the stair. Bowser does go on the stair. He is sandwiched between Bowser. Oh my god, Bowser does the- oh, wow! Bowser did the high shot. Yes, you can donate to the prize pool. All support that I generate this month, all of the support that I generate this month goes towards a higher prize pool for season three. More money for these runners, man. These guys deserve money. And True Hyper Mario does clutch it out with the 20 lives. 18, 18. Wow. What is that, 48? 48 to 36, right? 